Hi guys, Bea here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use our extra footer block. So you would use an extra footer if you want to display different footers on your home page and inside your internal pages or your blog post. You'll design this in Themes Generator. I'm using one of our premium themes called Winter. So as you can see, this theme already has a footer. So this would be my main footer. But if I want to add an extra footer, create a different design, then here in extra drag out the extra footer okay just to keep your template neat i would add the extra headers up where the header is and all the extra footers that you want to add here at the bottom okay near the main footer you can add as many extra footers as you want so i'll design something fast i'll make it different from the main footer so you can see the difference Okay, so first thing, I'm going to drag out the container because I'm going to add a background color. So once I add a container, I'm also going to get rid of this text block here. Right. So here in layouts, I'm going to get rid of the max width and set the width to 100%. Okay, so now I'm going to decorations to add a background color. So... I'm just going to choose a color so it's going to look just different from this one down here, okay? This main color. Sorry, this main footer. I'm going to leave it like that. And now I'm going to drag out this, a percent width box with three columns. So this is going to have a max width. Just set it to 100 pixels. And let's say, let's add an image here. I'm going to grab this first image to so just leave it here. I'm not going to change the, the percentage of each of the columns. I'm just going to leave it like that. Add text blocks. I'm making something really, really random. Let's say main um, I'm just gonna fast forward this part, okay? Okay, I'm done just before we export this theme into WordPress. Uh, you can always hide this extra footer and continue designing your home page, okay? So if you need to make any changes, just open it and close, right? Okay? So now's the time that we're going to export this to WordPress and then install the theme. So I've already installed the theme. It's going to scroll down and here you can see the main footer. So now I'm going to show you how to bring out the extra footer, okay? You'll do that here in Customize. I'm going to click customize and you can see here we have the extra footer one options so if you add a second extra footer then it will say extra footer two and so on so here we will select where we want to show this extra footer all right so i'm going to show it only in internal pages so this means that i have our main footer on the home page and the other one that i've just designed will be in internal pages. So, so here, whenever you select where to show your extra footer, you need to click on publish and close the customizer. So you will see the changes. If you don't do this, then you won't see the changes. All right. And I'm still on my home page, and I wanted this footer here. That's correct. But then now, sorry, I'm going to scroll up again. I'm going to a sample page. Okay. In sample internal page. And let's see how this extra footer looks. This is our sample page and I'm going to scroll down and there you go. So now you can check here on the home page. We still have our main footer, but in all internal pages, then I have my new extra footer. Okay. Remember you can add as many extra footers as you want and you can select in which pages you want to show which. 
So guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you don't want to miss any themes, generator, tutorial, and much more. Thank you guys for watching.